employees on a job site will be involved with hazardous substances on a varying level. However, it is important for all workers to understand the basic rules of protection so they can avoid mass contamination in the workplace. For this reason, employees who may come in contact with hazardous substances must learn how to properly reduce their risk of exposure through a process called decontamination. Our objectives for this lesson are to understand what decontamination is and why we need to use it, familiarize ourselves with the components of a formal decontamination plan, including the steps for preventing exposure, methods of appropriate decontamination, and a description of the decontamination area. We will also recognize possible modifications made to the decontamination plan and take a look at some commonly used equipment. According to OSHA standards, decontamination means the removal of hazardous substances from employees and their equipment to the extent necessary to preclude the occurrence of foreseeable adverse health effects. An employer must develop and implement a decontamination procedure that meets the requirements of OSHA standard 1910.120K. This decontamination procedure will be communicated to employees and implemented before any employees or equipment enter work areas where potential for exposure to hazardous substances exists. It is the responsibility of the employees to understand and utilize these procedures. Contamination can endanger workers both directly and indirectly. If personal protective equipment is not properly decontaminated, chemicals can eventually pass through a worker's suit and gloves. This endangers the worker directly, putting him or her at risk for possible skin exposure. Chemical vapors can also cause a worker to be indirectly exposed. For this reason, workers should avoid breathing residual chemicals when removing respirators and avoid contact with chemicals when removing suits and gloves. The blank is responsible for developing and implementing a decontamination plan. Congratulations, you have completed this section. Click the next button to continue.